Hello, my name is Martyr, and welcome to another one of these video vlog things, one of these blogs, whatever the hell they're called. Uh, it's where I kind of talk to you about something that I feel that is important, usually relating to gaming um, media in general, but today's going to be a little bit different. I want to talk to you about something that kind of personally happened to me, um, and then I'll bring it all back to gaming basically by the end of the video here. But, uh, something that kind of happened to me that really... Uh, bugged me something that kind of affected me is that someone uh, lied to me and uh, This person I don't want to get into too much details. I don't feel like some people should spill their dirty laundry, especially on the internet um, it's, it's no place for it, but I wanted to share this with you because it was it, it's an experience I had and it, 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 it's just something I need to get out of my basically my brain here um, And it, Lying to somebody is a horrible thing to do to somebody um, it, it takes everything that that person knows about you, especially if they discover the lie, and it completely reverses it. Because when you lie to somebody, when you deceive somebody, first off and foremost, several things are happening. You are showing a lack of respect. Um, you are showing a sign of distrust. And I know what you're thinking, oh, what about a little white lie? You know what, if, if that person is truly your friend or your, your family, whatever who it is, you should be able to always speak the truth to them, no matter the situation. Um, and lying is just, it's a very disgusting, horrible thing to do because, at least from my perspective, um, I, I can't look at that person the same now. When, anytime they tell me anything, I don't know if that is going to be the truth or if it's going to be a lie. Um, because it's just, it's completely, I would I never believe this person would lie to me. I'm completely blown away and astounded, floored. That this person would lie to me uh, and not only that then converse other people to lie on his behalf you know towards me basically he told other people to lie to my face for him um, and you know it's just it was it's a very it was very it in, impacted me it hurt me because it was unexpected and um, I always I always thought that this person had a great amount of respect for me because I respected them, I, I have great respect for this person, um, but it just it, it it hit me out of left field. So what's what's the point I'm trying to get to? What's the entire reason I'm sharing this with you guys? And is it is that honesty is, is an extremely important quality, guys. It's it's not only as a human being, but it should be something in everything that you do. Um, I always try to maintain positivity. I always try to be honest with you when I make these videos I always try to present to you the truth from what I believe you know from my angle as far as I believe it anyways um, and I do that in all things basically if you look at my channel for instance if you look at my steam profile you will see that I have never given any game a thumbs down now you may look at that and think okay well hey that's that's dishonest you're saying all these games are recommended you believe all these games are worth playing and to be honest with you I'm going to tell you Yes, not all of them were my cup of tea. No, that, that that is far from the truth. Some of them were more or less games that I may have not liked as much of others, but I don't know how to make a game. Not only that, that is somebody else's vision. That is someone else's creativity, someone else's hard work, learning a skill that I cannot even fathom. Like, I don't know how to program a game. I've never made a game. I, don't, I, I, I have really crappy art skills. I don't know how to make games. I don't want to enjoy games and then talk about them. Um, so for me to look at somebody's game and say, that game is not worth playing, it's ridiculous. I have no right to say that. What I do have a right to say, though, is that I did not like this, this, and this feature, whatever happens to be. But I will never, I don't believe in thumbs down. I don't believe in saying that isn't worth your time. This is crap. There's nothing redeeming about this. Because it's not... It's not honest. It's not real. Your opinions may differ from mine. Your your experiences may differ from mine. Uh, which is why I always say that I don't review games. Indie views are kind of exempt from that kind of thing. That's why I like about why I call them indie views is because they're they're their own thing. They're not reviews. They're not. They're kind of first impressions. They're just indie views. They're just you know that's all they are. That's all I want them to be. I don't want them to be, you know, a diehard definition of a yes or no answer. I will give you my opinion about the game. It is up to you to decide what you will do. And I will present that to you as honestly as possible. And it's just, it's important to me 
to always be honest with you guys, uh, with my family, with my friends, because I respect you. I respect you as viewers. I respect people in general. Uh, and I think it's a very important quality to just in general respect others. So when I make my videos or whenever I'm you know just hanging around, I, I just try to be as genuine as possible and, and present to you the truth. And in return, I, I would hope that other people would respect me. Now I, I'm not saying that the world in the world is a messed up place, and I'm not I'm not expecting that out of everybody. But if you're my friend, uh, if you're my family, and you lie to me it's it's devastating um and it's just it's a very hurtful thing to do do to people to lie guys so I, I know it's kind of a weird video i know this is kind of like a weird discussion but um it's just something i felt i wanted to share something that i want to talk about and you know also related to my channel in some ways you know and i can say journalistic integrity i'm not gonna look at you and say i'm a you know a critic or a journalist in any way but what i will say is that with whatever you want to call this channel, whatever you want to view it as, reviews, first impressions, whatever you want to call it, I always try to do it with honesty and positivity also. But I don't let my positivity blind me to things that may be of a fault. So if you know if a game's feature doesn't work, you know, I will bring that up. I will try to make that, you know, bring it up and make it obvious as possible. But at the same time, I'm not ever gonna look at you and tell you that something is crap. Ever because I don't know how to make games um, and I don't have the authority to say that what is crap and what is not. It's just not, it's not true. I'm not gonna look at somebody else's vision, somebody else's creation and say that it's crap. I'm just gonna say that, you know what? That is not my cup of tea. That I did not like this, this, and this about this feature, but that guy worked really hard on that. So if you like what you see, go ahead and get it. And that's how I operate my indie views. That's how I operate my channel. That's how I kind of operate as a person. I never look at somebody and I say, you know, whatever it is you're doing is crap. What are you doing? You're doing a shitty job. You know, I look at that person and say, okay, well, you know what? I can't do what that guy's doing. I'm not a doctor. I'm not a, you know, computer tech. I'm not a saucier, whatever, you know, I, I'm not gonna look at that person and say, you're doing a terrible job. I'm gonna say, you know what? If I happen to know something, I mean, you can do this, this, and this better at your job. Or, you know, this is what I did not like about your service. I'm not gonna look at that person and say that you did a shitty job though. I don't think that's a fair thing to do, and I don't believe in giving a thumbs down. I don't believe in, I think it's negative. Uh, and I think it's it's just, it all it leads is to confrontation and more, um, more just, just negativity in general. Um, so that's why I, I think being honest in everything that you do is very important. And I will always be honest with you guys. I'll be always honest with my opinion, my reviews, my, not my reviews, my indie views. Um, and I would hope in return that people would be honest with me. I would respect you and you'll respect me. So that's basically, that's all I really wanted to say. Thank you for watching guys. I hope you've enjoyed this little, uh, vlog, blog thing, guys. It's just something I had to get out and just, you know, get out of me and say, guys, um, maybe you have your own opinions. Maybe someone has lied to you. Um, maybe you don't believe in journalistic integrity. Maybe you don't believe in... Uh, positivity. Maybe you think I should be saying, hey, these, this game sucks. And, you know, give me your opinions. Anything you got. Um, that's what this is all about is feedback, of course. Thank you for watching, guys. And we will see you next time.